Good morning. Welcome to the vlog. I'm sitting here with Eileen. Actually, in fairness, I haven't done a lot of sitting down at all because I'm doing Eileen's blends this morning. And I thought I'd show you guys how I how I calculate the calories to make sure that we get uh, blends that are calorific enough and um, what else we do. So right now, Eileen is on her pump, but that is just water, nothing else. So she has had medicines and water so far this morning and it's already 9.30, so we are way, way, way behind on absolutely everything. But hey, what, what are you gonna do? So she needs to get some food into her. I have made a breakfast blend, so please come with me and uh, coffee, good morning. In this jar here, I have made a breakfast blend. And the blend that I have made uh, looks like this. It is 75 grams of porridge because she got the rest of the porridge that I had for breakfast, 96 grams of banana, 20 grams of peanut butter, 10 grams of maple syrup and 150 grams of apple juice. So I weigh everything uh, and yes it is time consuming. I've then put that through a calorie calculator and I've come up with that it's 14.4 grams of fat, 84.5 grams of carbohydrates, 12.2 grams of protein, and then the um, calculation you do is nine calories per gram of fat, four calories per gram of protein, four calories per gram of carbohydrate. So this ends up being 516.4 calories in 500 milliliters. So that one's packing calories, so that's really, really good. So I've made that. The next thing I'm gonna make is, I have this bag of leftover chili from yesterday. Um, what well, leftover chili? I made two kilo, nearly two kilograms of chili con carne yesterday. And again, in order to calculate the calories, you, you need to weigh everything. So here on the board, I basically weighed up everything I put in my chili. I then weighed the finished chili, and then I have weighed how much it is I'm actually giving Eileen. Uh, which is 410 grams. I'm also going to put 100 grams of Greek yogurt in and then enough water to make it um, possible to push through the tube. And then again, so I have my trusty book here uh, where I have calculated the fats, carbohydrates and proteins for the entire recipe, for the entire nearly two kilos. And then for the 410 grams I'm making for Eileen, and in the end how much we're actually talking and we are ending up with 964.6 calories in the chili blend that I'm going to be making. Uh, I don't yet know the volume because obviously I haven't actually made it yet. So that is how I do Eileen's blends and how we calculate the calories. And then we have the Excel spreadsheet that we have set up. Uh, and of course I've just moved away from my tablet so I can't show that but I will link that in the description below and I will actually link um, I will give you a link that you can go to and download this spreadsheet yourself and you can use it if you want to um, this is the spreadsheet that we have created to track how much fluid and how much calories we get into her we also put in her bowel movements we also put in her vomiting because we are medical parents and this is the kind of crap we need to, to keep track of. And we can even make up little pie charts in that Excel sheet of how much of the blend is fat, how much is protein and how much is carbohydrates. Uh, just to make sure that we get a good balance on it all. And apparently all of this is funny. Nuna, are you hungry? Oh, you are hungry. You want num nums? You want num nums? Shall I get a syringe and some feed and you over to your dad? Yes? Yes! And this is how we communicate with Ellen. So I'm going to grab a syringe. And you know what? I think Rob can get a brand new syringe today because we have had a delivery so let's get something that we can actually push through syringe feed 
And I'm gonna take her into the living room where Rob can give her some food. I'm gonna finish her feed and then I need to get cracking with work. Thank you so much for watching. See you soon, bye.